What is up boys and girls? We are in the studio. Um, I have not made a video in a while and I actually realized that the other day and I was like, bro, I need to make a video, like, real bad. So yeah, we out here, we're gonna be making a video on my studio and a tour of it. Um, it's a pretty simple, just like, home studio. I mean, I'm only 16 years old. This is the stuff I have. I mean, I think it's pretty decent for a 16 year old in his back room. Like, it's not that big of a deal. I just record friends for fun. Um, record myself, put my music out there, because I love music, and why not? It's a passion, so fulfill it. So yeah, we're gonna be doing a studio tour, so I'm gonna do a very fancy uh, montage of everything and then explain. So, let's do it. Alright, so after I hope you like that montage because I worked so freaking hard on that. I've never made one, so I hope that was at least midway decent. Yeah, let's start everything off with the most important thing. This is my HP Pavilion. Um, I use this on the daily. Uh, I do music producing, video editing. This is my most used tool in the toolbox. So yes, laptops, computer, anything you have that is super important. Up to that, I have my interface. This is a PreSonus AudioBox USB 96. Um, I have my Razer keyboard. I think this is the Black Widow Tournament Edition. I'm pretty sure. Just a basic wireless mouse. And then my Dell computer monitor. I use the computer monitor so much because it's so much easier to see everything. Mess with equalization. I, I just love a big screen for all that. So yeah, that's, that's why I use the big monitor. And then for my mic, I chose an MXL 2006. This is a studio condenser, large diaphragm microphone, and I love this thing. It picks up, it sounds so clear and crisp, and it's it's just honestly an amazing microphone. So much better than my first microphone. But guys, I just want to make it a matter of fact that if you do not have the most expensive gear in the world, if you bought a $15 microphone off of Amazon, it works. I mean, I have made so many songs on my SoundCloud with a $15 microphone, and I learned so many things from it. So just pursue it, work hard on it, because you can do a lot with just like the cheapest stuff in the world. I'm, I'm serious, it, it moves you so far until you can afford things like a really expensive microphone and a nice interface. Like, it just takes time. You gotta learn things along the way, get yourself better, then get a job, and then you can buy those things, get even better, and then maybe one day have music as a career. Not that I have that as a career, but I'm just saying, that's kind of just how the scale works. I started out with crap, now I'm with something better. Maybe one day I'll be with something even better. But right now I'm satisfied with the stuff I have. Up next I have this Yamaha Portable Grand DGX 2200, 205. Um, this is a grand piano keyboard that my grandfather gave me. Yeah, he gave it to me. Um, because it was just sitting in his house and he never really used it because he has a real grand piano and a much nicer electric piano. So he just gave it to me. He's a nice grandpa. Then I have a Fender amp right down there. Um, that's more my brother's. I don't really use it that much. I don't like it as much. Um, I have a Line 6 down there. I can't remember which one it is. Um, just basic amps to record guitar. Then I have three guitars here. I have a Takamini, a Ibanez, and then a Seagull. Uh, these are all very expensive. My Takamini is about a 900. I believe it was 900, something like that. Um, my brother's was about 1100 and then this one 
I think this one was 902, if I if I remember correctly. And so, yeah! I had to turn the light on, but then next we have my drum set. I've had this for years. Super terrible cymbals. Like, really terrible. I need to upgrade this thing, but I don't have money right now to do that. So I'm just good with what I have, as I said before. Um, this snare is actually very, very nice. This is a Grush Catalina Club. Um, this is a pretty nice snare. It goes for like 130 U's. And I got it for free from a friend, so I'm happy with that. And then I have a Thomas Swing Star drum set. It's similar to the kind that Metallica uses as a Thomas Swing Star. So yeah, I, when he said that, I was like, yeah, I'll take that one. I have these nice paintings. My uh, brother's ex-girlfriend, I think, painted that one. And I think he painted this one. So yeah, <laughs> nice artwork. <laughs> a whiteboard for when you get ideas, because believe it or not, writing down your ideas, I'm serious guys, it's the biggest help. You just write out the song on a big old whiteboard. It's right in front of the microphone. So literally you just sit there and you look down and you're like, oh, okay. I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love. You can even write notes so you can have freestyle but add some notes. It's, it's just really helpful. So the other thing I have is my stereo. Um, my stereo, it's a pretty basic stereo but it gets the job done for me. Um, it's a... I don't even remember what kind of amp that is down there, but I have just a cheap sub that I got for like 10 bucks at uh, Goodwill. Goodwill, that's where I got it. And then I have some Philips highs that I got from my cousin, and that thing down there, I can't remember the kind of amp, but I just wired it all up, and it sounded nice, so I was like, let's roll with it. Then I'm guessing y'all are going to want to know the software I use. The first software I use is Studio One, right there. And then I also use FL Studio on I just I use free programs. Studio One wasn't free. I will make that a fact. That that's not free. Um, I'm working towards getting Pro Tools. So hopefully Pro Tools, because that is an awesome program. That is like my dream. To have Pro Tools one day. So yeah. Guys, that concludes my studio, studio tour. I hope you guys liked it. Um, I will be posting more videos in the future. So just. Comment, tell me what you want me to do, uh, subscribe, I'm definitely going to work harder on making videos at least once a week, so yeah, peace.